Hey guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel. Welcome to the best online soccer manager channel in YouTube. And today, guys, after you was asking me a lot of times, we got company tactics with Bayern de Munich, which are amazing. And you will see that has amazing results. So basically, let's start, guys, and let's go with the lineups. Uh, I will say you that company can use three lineups, which are two really easy to use in online soccer manager and one a little bit more difficult so basically you can use 43a you can use 43b which i will show you now but uh like always guys i recommend you to to put all the players in his right positions you can use here 43b which is so similar to 43a it's exactly the same but just change that 43b has a central defensive midfield so it's a little bit more defensive and you can use 4231, which is uh, a little bit more difficult because we don't have too many left midfields and right midfields in the game. Uh, the only thing that you can do is convert these, uh, these players. I mean, to convert a midfield to right midfield or to left midfield is the only way to do that. Uh, because if not, we don't have any other option. You will see. We will start creating the team. So for the striker, we have Harry Kane. For the goalkeeper, uh, we have Manuel Neuer. I don't know here why I put Ulrich, but uh, we will put right now Manuel Neuer, like goalkeeper. Uh, left back, we have Davies. For the central back, we have Kim in Jae. We have Upamecano. And for the right back, we will have uh, Stanisic, which is really good. Uh, let's go now for the offensive midfield, which got Musiala, we got Kimmich, we got Goretzka, and now we have the problem here. Because usually in the real life, this is not a problem because you can put their uh, Coman and Sané, which uh, they will play in that position in the real life. In FIFA or in FC, FC 25, you can do it the same, it's not any problem. But here is problem with the position because, for example, Coman and Sané will play there, of course, but will not perform the same like in like if they are in his original positions. So uh, will affect to the team. Will affect to the team. I try it like that, and every time uh, some games okay for new, three new, but uh, most of them guys is so difficult. So you can see if we put Musiala there, it's fine. It's not a green. Uh, screen, but uh, it's a okay position for him. He can play there. But my recommendation, guys, uh, always try to go to the transfer list, see what you have. If you have these two positions to buy, it's fine. But if no, guys, uh, I recommend you guys to buy some central attacking midfields. Like, for example, here, that in the transfer list, we don't have these two positions that we are looking for. So you will have to choose two. So in that case, I will choose, like, for example, Madison and I will choose Cole Parmel. And uh, after that, I will convert them to, to left midfield and right midfield. So, for example, Madison can play like left midfield and Palmer can play like right midfield without any problem. So like that, guys, is the, is the only way to complete this 4-2-3-1 lineup is the only way, guys. It's not any other way. So now, guys, uh, really important. Always, I told you guys, like, it's so important to have an equilibrate team. For example, we have Hurricane with 90, Musiala with 89, Neuer with uh, 87. It's fine. But the rest of the players, they have 85, 82, 84 of overall. So it's important, guys, to have the rest of the players with the same 89, 88 overall, at least. So the team will play much, much better than, for example, right now. Let's go now with the specialist, guys. For the specialist, always, like captain, I recommend you the most oldest player in the team. In that case, we got Manuel Neuer. For the penalties, I recommend you the best striker, winger that you have. In that case, of course, Harry Kane. Uh, for the free kicks, guys, always I recommend you the best forward or midfield. But in that case, to change a little bit, to then give all the responsibility to Harry Kane, we will choose Musiala, who is really good. And he has 89 of overall, which is fine. And for the corners, we will take Kimmich, which is fine for the corners to don't give the same responsibility to Musiala for the corners, free kicks and everything. So this will be the specialist, guys. And now we will see the tactics, which you will like a lot. OK, guys, so here we have the tactics, the part that you most like of the videos. 
So the game plan, guys, basically company plays wing play, but you can play as well passing game. Both of them are really good options, uh, are working for these three lineups. Uh, basically, which I recommend you guys, if you have better wingers in your team than midfields, uh, play with the wingers. If you have uh, better midfields than wingers, use passing game. So basically use which one you like more. About the tackling guys, um, company likes really aggressive teams. So in that case, for the tackling, we will use aggressive. Of course, you can use normal. You can use uh, anything that you want uh, because about the referee, it's totally different. But for example, me, 90% of the times I use aggressive and 10% of the times I'm, I use normal. Let's go with the line tactics, guys. For the forwards, they will only attack. They will do nothing else. So Hurricane will only have to attack. We don't have to defend. For the midfields, uh, you can choose them to stay in position. But I think uh, company likes the midfields to attack. So Kimmich, Goretzka, Musiala to score more goals and to give more assists. And the defenders just to defend deep. Don't worry about Davies. Don't worry about the fullbacks because they will attack. They will uh, score goals. They will do assists. So it's not any problem. But if you really want them to attack a lot, like for example, you see in reality Davies that he's in attack like another winger, you can choose the defenders, I mean the fullbacks to attack. But I recommend you, like personal recommendation, the midfields just to stay in his original positions. So to be like a little bit box to box to do a little bit of everything. So now, guys, uh, we will go with the numbers, with the numbers which are really important. Uh, so basically, I will leave the line tactics like that that you see over there. So let's go with the numbers, guys. About the pressing, uh, I saw Bayer the Munich that is pressing a lot because they, they want to win the balls and uh, they want to have the possession of the ball. So in that case, we will use 78 of pressing. About the style, guys, uh, Bayern de Munich, it's a team that uh, they attack a lot, that they want to score as many goals as possible, like to be like almost invincible. So they will do 78 of attacking. About the tempo of the passing, they have really good team. So they will use 88 of passing, guys. 88, almost tiki-taka, so which Bayern de Munich can play like that. But for example, if you have another team that which is not Bayern de Munich and is not really good like Bayern de Munich, you can use 78 of passing, guys. It's not any problem or even less passing to accurate the passing, to, to be more sure about the passing and to don't lose the ball. So like that, you can use 78, you can use 68 if you want, you can try. But basically, I recommend you between 78 and 88. In that case, with this Bayern de Munich, the original tactic is like that. So let's go now. I mean, offside, we will not use any offside. Marking, we will use on our marking. So these are the original tactics that I saw watching a lot of matches and trying a lot of tactics for this company, Bayer de Munich. So let's go now with uh, some things, guys. Uh, basically, I told you you can use this tactic with 4-2-3-1, 43A and 43B. So let's go now with the results, guys. You can see four new against this Paris Saint-Germain using the 4-2-3-1 with two players out of his positions. In that case, Kane scored four goals. This is amazing. Uh, basically, uh, Sané and Coman was playing well, but I think uh, they could do much better, for example, with a better lineup. For example, here we was using 43 and you can use against Inter de Milan, which is a really difficult team. We scored three goals, Sané, Sané and Coman. In that case, they appear now. 14 shots, more than 60% of position of the ball. And uh, the formation that Inter de Milan used was 5-3-1-1, which is more difficult to score goals against them. But even like that, guys, we scored three goals. Let's go in another match. We got Bayern de Munich against Manchester City, which is really difficult because Manchester City, they have better team than us. You can see Harry Kane scoring a lot of goals. Kimmich, Coman, Kane. I mean, Kane is scoring almost two or three goals per uh, per match with this tactic, which is amazing, which I think company wants from Harry Kane as well. So the team is working amazing. You can see 5-1 against Manchester City. 5 new against Juventus, which is uh, Juventus. It's a really difficult team as well because they have good team. Similar to Bayern de Munich, I think. And also, you know that Juventus, like they are Italians, they defend really well. Harry Kane again with three goals. Uh, I don't know how many goals scored Harry Kane in this video, but that's amazing. That's crazy. 
So five new against Juventus, four new against Atletico de Madrid, which is difficult team as well, which is similar to Bayern de Munich, 18 shots, more than 60% of possession. Four new against Milan, which is a more normal team, but uh, also they have really good team. You can see the same, a lot of possession. Uh, you can see now uh, as well, guys, in the real game with Atletico de Madrid, not only friendlies. Uh, we are the first one in the league, five wins, uh, 19 shots, four score. I mean, they score us only four goals, which is okay, it's normal. And uh, you will see the result, guys, which are really good. The results are really good for Atletico de Madrid. We will go now here in the match calendar. And you see 4-1 four, four against Sevilla, 4-2 against Betis. 5-0 against Villarreal, 3-0 against Celta de Vigo, 3-1 against Las Palmas. And you can see also with this Borussia Dortmund that we are using these tactics. 0-2 uh, against Bruce, 8 new against Celtic. Uh, against Real Madrid was difficult uh, because they have better team than us for a lot, a lot of... It's a lot of difference, but also we, we, we get there one point. Uh, similar match, so, so, so similar match. Uh, Madrid was a little bit much better, but even like that, uh, they couldn't win us. And after, you can see that we scored 10 goals in two games. That's crazy. 